Mankind has come a long way since it first began to stand upright. But according to a new study of fossils, from the female Australopithecus, a human ancestor, the road was not only a long one, but also a diverse one when it comes to bipedal walking. These are the remains of a particular Australopithecus named Issa. And here's what Lee Berger, an anthropologist who worked on the study, had to say about her. Issa walked somewhat like a human, but could climb like an ape. So how do they know? Well, Issa's fingers and feet appear highly specialized for climbing, like an ape. But the way in which her upper leg or her femur bone attaches to her knee tells a different story. The angle is such that she would have been more suited to upright walking, and a micro CT scan of her lower vertebrae revealed a curved lower spine, which is similar to our own, and built that way to maintain a bipedal position, meaning Australopithecus was likely one of the earliest bipedal humans, and what the researchers call a true intermediary between man and ape.